it's picking up now. I hope. Yay! Ah! Uh, I'm back now. I think. I hope. God, I'm hoping everything's back. If not, I'm gonna have to be like, no! Uh... Am I gonna have to go back to... Well, that's upsetting. Yeah, it works, but, like, my CPU is being overworked currently, which is upsetting. That's really upsetting. So several sequences are going to be played. We're going to go ahead and actually play them. CCD in glory grates my ear. Forgive me. When I saw you awaken, I could not... It was such a relief. We feared you might never wake up. Now, now, Astinian. If Master Alphano thought any less of you... Astinian, both of this double ye. Or dead. Aye, aye, twas but a jest. I thank you, Alphano. And you too, warrior of light. Quite how you managed to persuade Thosa with the aid of his druid brother's downfall, I cannot imagine. But full glad am I that you do. But again, you have achieved the impossible. I, for my part, owe you an apology. When last we met, I did willingly loose an arrow at your heart. Can you forgive me? There is naught to forgive, Hammerick. You but acted in defense of Ishgard as is your duty. 
Were you any less single-minded about it, I would not follow you into battle and trust you at my back. Besides, I had come to the self-same conclusion that I would have to perish for Nidhogg to be stopped. So let us dispense with the hand-wringing. I have heard enough wooing for one day. Oh! Tendrils of Nidhogg's foul presence bound up every fiber of my being, usurping my senses, but I yet retain some trace of who I am. The villainous mine of which it was a vast and tumultuous sea, endlessly with its black waters churned, his grief and despair at Rakatoska's murder never calming, never receding. Driven by this surging current came wave upon wave of unrelenting rancor. It was the very image of my own heart. There I saw the dark reflection of the hatred I felt after Nidhogg slew my family. When no path remained save vengeance against dragon kind. I was blessed with something Nidhogg was not. Comrades and teachers to console and admonish me. Had I not had them to gainsay my obsession, they would surely have consumed me as Nidhogg's did him, and we would have been in all respects alike. Commander, my hunt is at an end. I would lay down the mantle of Azure Dragoon. Thy friend. He has tired himself with too many words. I doubt not that he will make a full recovery, but he must be allowed some few days of too must see my path to its end. Sleep well, my friend. Following the battle with Nidhogg on the Steps of Faith, Sir Emery called an assembly that he might make his final proclamation as acting head of state. Twas there, with one decree, that the thousand-year rule of the archbishops was ended, paving the way for a new republic. The governance of Ishgard would now be placed in the hands of high and lowborn alike, 
their ranks represented by the newly founded House of Lords and House of Commons. Church was separated from state. The foundation for change had been carefully laid, and the reforms proposed by Ishgard's new government passed into law without incident. His duty done, Emmerich de Borel gladly stepped down from the archbishop's dais, only to be raised into the highest seat in the House of Lords. Though he strove at first to refuse this honor, the unexpectedly strident voice of the Count de Durandere left him little choice but to accept. Not yet. Not yet. Not yet. And that's still a few exp- uh, that's still a few. You know it's coming. Yeah, I know. I know. But not yet. Prominent among the many honored guests at Sir Emmerich's investiture were the ambassadors of Dragonkind. A fitting symbol of Ishgard's newfound peace. People looked on in awe as he soared through the heavens on dragon back. And by their cheers did they hail him an azure dragoon for a new age. But he's not a dragoon. Alright, I I have an issue with that. My baby. Speaking of babies, um, for, for FanFest, they pushed out little minion figurine. And my Astinian that I had ordered is, has finally shipped. It's shipped on the 3rd, and it looks like it's in Houston now. So I am excited, because holy fuck, I get my little Astinian. Thus were the notes of the dragon song rewritten. The din of war, giving way to a rising litany of peace and hope. And that recounts his uh, story for Heaven's Word. Dragon's Word. Um, it's going to be beautiful after that. Word.
Roll credits. Yeah. I think credits do roll. I, I don't- I know they'll roll- Oh, no! What's this? Do I forget me? Friend Wedge was active as this research facility. Uh, okay. I mean, let me talk to Sir Amor real quick. Ow. <laughs> I don't wanna. Don't mind me. That's what I want to know. I go up there. You are. I've been waiting for you, Illy. Feel lonely without her, so I snuck back. And she was looking. Now look at her. Now no. Let alone you in the wasteland. All right, we'll do that in a moment. I actually have to go use the bathroom again, so I'm gonna be right back.
I forgot to unmute myself, but I'm back. Hi. Um, I'm gonna be honest, I don't know if I'm gonna go for much longer for, for stream. Um, I, I know I had this planned. I, I, I know I had 14 planned, but I just, I don't want to stream. <laughs> I did my art. I kind of want to do some more art, but off stream. So we'll, we'll at least, um, thank you. Well, um, You do what you. Yeah, I, I, I really. I've just, I've just not been feeling it. Last couple of days. Oh, it's a dungeon. Oh, okay. I will do that later. Yeah, like I said, I really, really don't want to do this. But that's also because my, my, uh, my finger hurts also. Uh, government's new airships have been saying can travel a select distance locales from landing a fish car. Oh. I, uh, I was moving shit last night and I had accidentally hurt my index finger, so... Sorry, I didn't mean to cough into the mic and make it peak. Yeah, so my finger hurts right now. I just... I just don't want to do it. I'll end up splicing everything together for, for my stream. Um... I think I have a look, it's a little bus. Uh nay you remain there. We should we shall rain rendezvous at the usual place. All is proceeding as expected. I there is not to concern us, there is a side of one curious mouth. Hey, look. It's, uh, yeah. Why try to disguise it? I saw the ribbon. It's Alice. There's 
they're referred to as the Warriors of Darkness, but to be honest, I, I do. And thus did the gray mist to give way to azure skies. Man and dragon rise above, voices join in song, but beneath shrouded rose, uh, bows beyond the scope of lights of shadow stirs. Yeah. We can't talk about that. That's a hush hush thing. So we can't we can't talk about that. Uh really I gotta go back inside? Oh no I don't. I'll at least grab this one. Cause this is the start. Uh Eric wants to go on a date. Oops, wrong one. Only one looks homeless. Well met. Action. Oh. Dan cred before dadhood. Yeah, it's it's uh, it's uh, Ninkred. He's a, he is head of Chromic actually. He's head of Chromic now. would prove such harsh taskmasters. <laughs> Forgive me. I did not know you had suffered so in your quest for the horn. I don't think it's actually him being blind. It's blue compared to his uh, other eye. I must say, your spirit it's not like you still a welcome change from the arid reports which fill my days. Back off, bitch. Though I have lived in these lands my entire life, to hear you speak of them, there is much and more I have yet to see. Truly, yours was a marvelous journey. Uh, why not join me on the next one? Oh, hi, Viperdine. Thanks for the raid. <laughs> well, truth be told, when I think back on the sweeping vistas of the churning mists, how was your stream? Slight pangs of wanderlust. Alas, much as I would like to accept your invitation, I fear my present duties with the House of Lords demand my undivided attention. I... <laughs> Reading so bad of stage. Fair enough. By your deeds, you have helped but hi, guys. to lay the foundation for lasting reform. 
The formation of the Republic is but the beginning. Ugh. For it is not only our system of governance which must needs change. That's fine. We, we were while leveling my machinists for a while. Okay. Above our bloody past. So I want to clarify I for. I live long enough to see us achieve some measure of success. I want to. I want to clarify for those who just came in. in uh, this is not my first time going through through uh, fourteen. I, um, I have a main. This is an alt that I made with to play with a couple of friends. Uh, but it is definitely one of those. Hello, Abby. Thank you for the thank you for the raid. Um, and so I'm just going through the content, and I don't really remember Heaven's Word. Um, I remember bits and pieces, but that's about it. Uh, how's your stream going? I've had technical. T I had have had technical difficulties today, Viper. Um, anywhere between my OBS. Uh, uh, <laughs> between my OBS freezing, freezing on me to my mouse and keyboard not wanting to, to actually like acknowledge that I was like tapping at it. Uh, thank you for the follow, Abby. You have a pretty, you have a very cute YouTuber. Aw, oh, thank you. Through Heaven's Word last week. Yeah, like I said, I'm all caught up. I'm completely caught up. I used to raid, but then my raid group fell through, so I've not been doing all the raiding this uh, this tier. But um, I I'm just I'm just trying to get through the content again, and and I mean, I I, I <laughs> I'm hating my life right now because I chose Paladin, um, uh, and and normally I'm playing either White Mage or Astro. So, but yeah, I I am hating life right now. And I don't, I'm actually going to probably end up uh, either switching games or ending stream entirely because I'm just, I'm not in the right head zone, if that makes any sense. May I ask a personal but I, I don't, I don't know just yet. Now that the dust has settled, what will you do? Not as a scion, I mean, but what do you want for yourself? Hi, Scraper. Lord Commander, pray forgive the interruption. That'll toughen you up. Go tank or go News broke. I, I've played the tanks before. Don't get me wrong. Um urgent message for the Warrior of Light. I was instructed to deliver. I, I have played uh uh all the new tanks Must on my main. Um I have Dark Knight to eighty, I have Warrior and Paladin, I believe at seventy four and seventy two respectively. Um and I absolutely hate uh, Gunbreaker. I, I don't like it, so. How are you doing, Mocha? I'm doing good, Nano. How are you? You must go to them, my friend. And I shall go with you. Oh, also, the reason why I, I don't know if I want to continue streaming um, is is because I had hurt my, uh, in, uh, my middle finger yesterday moving shit around. Like I had bent the the nail backwards into like a ninety degree angle, so my my thing is just super hurt. Marks a new beginning. But don't do like Abby and go healer. Okay, okay. Once we get past, out of this, I I will switch. I will switch to my main, and you guys will see what I play. And if you guys are that curious, I will. Because again, I've done savage content. I've cleared savage content. Um, I will. I will show you my. I will show you my logs. So, best of vibes heading your way. No, no. It just hurts. This isn't the first time I've done it. So. Yeah, like I said, I'll. I'll switch over. I'll switch over real quick. I don't mind. It'll. It'll give me something to talk about at least. So. Because I really, really don't want to do this. The next dungeon is something I don't want to do. Ooh, I just want to get to fucking Belzer's Wall. When you have time, you should watch what happened during Abby's last stream. Fair enough, fair enough. I'll, I will when I get the time. It seems not pleasant. Are you ice packing that thing right now? No, I'm not, sadly. Um, I, it, it, I've been taking painkillers for it. So it's not that big of a deal right now. So just started playing a month ago. I barely just started. I'm barely starting. Bloodborne or St Stormblood. Sorry. Wow. I'm, I'm thinking of Bloodborne for some reason. Uh, definitely giving. The, the game is definitely giving good, good serotonin. 
Yeah, it's just, it's a drag when you've already been through it. So it, it's it's not fun to have to do it again. Um, I, the only, so as everyone probably knows, uh, the boosts are on sale currently. I just went ahead and bought the, the Paladin boost because, uh, fuck that. <laughs> I was 50 going into the uh, in-game 50 content. I, I really don't want to level Paladin again. Um... And so I went ahead and bought that, and I've been soloing a lot of the stuff by myself. I, it just takes me 30 minutes to do the 60 shit. Um, so I'm definitely really postponing the, the, the idea of having to go through here. I don't trust anyone in Finder. Um, so so this, is, this is my main. Ain't she cute? She's adorable. Uh, actually. So I... Actually, main is white main. Um, I've been playing a little bit around, like, ever since I dropped my content, uh, my, rating, my rating content, I've actually been playing Astro, so I do have Astro. Um, I have a good chunk of them leveled, as you can see. I, as you can also see, I'm primarily a magic player. Um, I Dancer was my first one that I ever got to 80 for, for Shadowbringers itself. And it just kind of was like that to summoner, which I ended up doing this uh, the healer ship shit as scholar, which I don't like scholar. I don't like how it plays. Um, and then I went into level white mage, dark knight, dragoon, and yeah, I, I just ended up playing a lot of uh, white mage. Um, like I said, I, I have content cleared. As you can see, I have uh, the the choir head from last year so i have done do savage i have done savage content as a white mage um again if you guys are curious i will definitely pull up my vlogs i don't mind showing them i i know i'm not the best healer i'm i am not the best healer but i'm an okay healer so i know what the fuck i'm doing when it comes to healing and i absolutely enjoy it so i i i, I the reason why i say that is because i saw i saw people going uh don't don't play healer you you're you're good you're good as tank I actually prefer to heal. <laughs> so, I, I, because I prefer to heal, I typically try to, um, not shoot myself when I'm playing healer classes. Uh, like I said, I don't, I don't like, what other games do you like playing uh, the, besides this game? Um, I typically play a lot of RPGs, uh, especially Japanese role-playing games. Um, I played Persona, I, I Persona 5, I beat Royal, I beat both of them. Um, I'm currently on stream, which is going to start, start again tomorrow. I'm currently playing uh, Skyward Sword, but I'm going into a part that I absolutely despise, so I'm like kind of prolonging it. Um, I was playing Pokemon Snap, I have Pokemon or Monsters, uh, Monster Hunter stories. Uh, yeah, I, I'm typically a, uh, I typically play a lot of Japanese uh base games um on on wednesday i have this new thing called uh retro wednesday where i play um uh where i go and play retro games from whatever collection i have and then go into to emulators and um and uh yeah. <laughs> uh I'm, I'm playing silent hill 2 at the moment uh, have you tried the new trails yet? No, I have not. I have not tried the new trails. Alize, Alfino's twin sister. I I knew of, I know about them, but I haven't played them yet. She ran afoul of the warriors of darkness. I really don't want to do this dungeon. I had been tracking them since the ceremony at Falcon's Nest. Little did I know I was not the only one. Evidently, she had learned of their activities and attempted to shadow them on her own. Poorly. I rescued her in the Twelves Wood, and together we fled north. But though I made every effort to cover our tracks, they caught up with us on the Ishgardian border. And in the ensuing struggle, Alize took an arrow to the shoulder. It was only after we had made good our escape that I realized it was poisoned. Thank you for coming so quickly. And you, Sir Emmerich. Think nothing of it. How is she? 
We have done all we can for now. Although the immediate danger has passed, the poison yet lingers in her blood. We came to Eorzea together, hoping to bring salvation to the realm our grandfather gave his life to protect. But when confronted with the bitter realities of its politics and its petty powermongers, she was driven to anger and to doubt. She refused to become embroiled in what she termed Eorzea's squabbles and distanced herself from the Scions. Though she remained hopeful of a brighter future, she would walk her own path. Would that it had not been so perilous. For all our differences, she's as dedicated as any scion to the salvation of Eorzea. But more than that, she is my sister. To be reunited with her, only to lose her forever. Gods, even to speak the words. Take heart, Master Alfino. She will be attended by our most skilled Kairujans. Bear Mistress Levea to the infirmary at once. Apprise Captain Whitecape of the situation and inform him that she is to be treated as my personal charge. Wait, don't go. Please, come closer. The warriors of darkness are in league with the Assonance. Slaughtering the Primals is but the first step in their plan. They make for Zelfatol to bring about Garuda's summoning and to kill her. Oh, you, you must. You must stop them. Uh, if you're done, if you're... Don't mind me, Prine. How long have you been overall? Um... Sorry, I, I just, I, I was super into this cutscene. I'm so sorry. Um, Master Thancred, I would ask that you accompany Mistress Levea to the infirmary. Your knowledge of her injuries may well prove useful in determining her treatment. So technically speaking, I actually ended up um, doing... Uh, I ended up doing a lot of streaming... <laughs> Quotations around streaming, uh, or, or a lot, a lot of streaming. Um, so what I ended up doing was I ended up uh, streaming back in 2017. Um, it was very off and on because I had a job at the time, and so like because of that, I well, didn't actually like keep it up and everything. Um, and so. Like, that was an off and on thing back in 2017. So it was off and on, then it was off and on back in 2018 and 2019. So I, I had, like, off and on streams for, for about two years. Uh, last year. Last year, last year, last year, last year. Last year, and it, as, as everyone knows, we had a pandemic. Um, uh... We end up having, uh, I, I, at the time, had quit my job at a local geek store um, because it was just too much of a commute because I, I don't drive. I don't drive. I absolutely hate the idea of driving. So I went to work closer to my home. I worked as an in-store shopper for about a year, and last year, about October-ish, uh, no, actually it was August. It was about August time frame. They had come down and said, we don't need our in-store shoppers anymore. We are letting you guys go. Be, basically be free to the wind kind of thing. 
Um, also, hi, hi, smoking. How, how are you? Um, because of that, give me that card. Um, because of that, I didn't want to go back into into retail because I had do had done two retail jobs at the at that time. Um, I had worked for GameStop, and then I had worked for Thinky. And so I had decided that I was not going to do another like nine to five job, another part time job after after my um, after my my let go of my in store shopping job. And so after that, I decided that I was going to start streaming. Um, retail hell is a real thing. It is. I, I actually suffer from anxiety. Um, I suffer from social anxiety, which is hilarious because I'm a streamer. Um, I, I don't like crowds. So like the Christmas time, the holiday time was awful for me. Um, I worked at a mall with, for my Think Geek job. Um, I worked on the second floor also, so do I, I have a fear of falling, a fear of heights, that, that was, ooh, mwah, that was all I could say, mwah. Um, but because I had worked at these places and I knew what I was encountering, I mean, one Christmas, I had, um, I had someone tell me that they wanted me to give them or just, so they 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 I was trying to sell this hammer that Think Geek was selling. It was Thor's hammer, but it was an actual tool set. It was super fucking cool. These these this family asked me if they could use my employee discount to get a discount. And I just I was like, I'm done. I'm done. I had a group of teenagers piss me off. Um, because again, I don't, I, I don't do good in confrontation. Um, and, and after that, I was just done. Um, I, my, my, my job for, um, um, okay, cool. Um, my job for, what was it, uh, for in-store shopping, I had the, um, I had a couple of women who were of color, um, and this this was actually smack dab in the middle of COVID. Don't so I I was doing everything because I'm I after COVID I I became a major germaphobe. Like I was that already, but it ended up getting worse. Um, I was doing everything the like the social distancing. I made sure that I was washing my hands. If I touched something, I had hand sanitizer on my hand almost immediately. So I, I was making sure I was taking care of myself. At the grocery store that I worked at for a as a in-store shopper, they also were doing that, and I had like five items for one order, and these these two ladies were right next to the next to the to the pin, and because of how they were had doing the social distancing, I couldn't just like reach over and, and swipe my thing because that wasn't going to be six feet from the cash uh, from the cashier. So I, I will admit it was super snotty, but I was already pissed off because people were not respecting my, my, my space. And I basically told them to back the fuck off. Politely, of course. Because again, I'm, I'm, the, the, the attire that I had was like super neon and it had like the, the, the company across the chest. Um, but I politely told them to back the fuck off. I cannot check out with them there. And they basically rolled their eyes, said sorry, backed it off, and the cashier apologized for my for, for it. And the cashier didn't tell them to back off. So yeah, this is the reason why I stream, is because I cannot do it anymore. I, I physically cannot handle um the shit like that. <laughs> Please respectfully fuck off. Yeah. I I I don't understand because, like, again, we were all wearing masks, so I think because of the masks, they were like, oh, I don't have to social distance, but I physically could not check out because they were in my way. <laughs> and I, I will, oh, I, I feel bad, don't get me wrong, I feel remorseful for doing that, but I absolutely hated it. And I really, really don't want to do this. I don't want to sit in a queue and I don't want to sit here for 30 minutes. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm, I'm being so, like, I don't want to do this. Um, 
But, uh, yeah, no, that was, oh, I, I did not enjoy that. So, I do, it's an, uh, ineptism and Karenism. Yeah, I, I'm sure it was actually both of those. Uh, again, I'm out of it, so it's not like it's that big of a deal at the moment, but, um, it's because of COVID, I actually don't leave the house. Um... If I do, it's because I know I need to leave. Like, I've actually been suffering from uh, mild depression as of recently. So, being able to actually go out and, and do something is helping. But I don't do it too often. Uh, not only that, I can't afford it. <laughs> because I don't have a secondary income. Um, my, uh, I, I, I currently live with my parents and my boyfriend lives with me. I'm not trying to make it into a pity party. I'm just, you know, trying to give you guys information about myself. Um, what else? I'm lactose intolerant. Can you imagine a cat girl being lactose intolerant? Oh, shit. I don't want to do this. Let's see how we do. Let's see how we do uh, with it being undersized. But yeah, can you imagine a cat girl being uh, lactose intolerant? That's weird. I'm lactose intolerant. Um, there's a, a Vietnamese market I go to often, but in the beginning of the second wave, like late August, September, the place was packed and no social distancing whatsoever. And I took three steps in and looked around and said, nope, fuck that. Yeah. Um. I remember when you told me that you were out, you were without job. Yeah, it, it's it's been uh some time ago when when i found your channel it, it's something that i don't mind talking about um here let me turn this down it's actually really loud in my headset okay uh i i don't mind talking about it because it's something that happens to just be a thing that happened um and so it's, again, it's something I don't mind. Um, and to be honest, I'm not like... Oh, thank you for the follow, uh, gentle Grunder. Grundler. Grundler. My bad. Relatively going well. Um, but no, I, I, I don't try to make it into a whole, like, sob story or anything. Like, it, it's annoying. I, I have to be very, um... I have to be very, very careful as to what I end up using, or using the money for, so, that I end up getting from streams. Uh, but the fact that I end up having such a, such a caring community that is willing to to listen to me rant if I have a if I have something bothering me, it, it means a lot. Um, and I would I would never give it up for anything. Um, I I will admit I had contemplated on getting another job. Um, issue is is I would have to cut down on my uh, on how many hours I stream so it's obviously something I can't do but uh yeah by the way yeah I know I'm, I'm playing paladin pretty badly but I mean I'm just trying to get through this yeah I uh <laughs> Uh, the other day, I didn't do it on stream. I, I think I did it on Tuesday. No, I did it on Monday. Uh, a friend of mine that I play this game with played played this game with. Uh, I was doing Nidhogg and uh. I, 
I was playing, I was playing something. Or I was doing, yeah, like I said. Whoop. Um. I was playing that. I was playing this. I'm sorry. I, I have a super short attention span sometimes. Uh. But yeah, basically, I, I was doing Nidhogg with her friend, and said friend had died during- right before ads. Right before those three ads. And, um, that was hell. That was ultimate hell. That was- that was not fun. I had thought I was going to not survive multiple times for multiple tank busters uh, it, it was it was not fun it and she she had died during because I had done sword Kai with her too I, I didn't want to do sword Kai I, I hate sword Kai um, and that 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 was fun too for you're playing pretty well from what I see and I don't play 14. Um, I could do better. I could definitely do better, but I don't play Paladin often. Um, it's not my class, so I don't even know what the opener is. I really should look at it, but like, I don't wanna. <laughs> Alright, bitch, go up. Oh shit. Um, no, why'd you do this? Why'd you have to make it hard for me, man? Yeah, it, it, the, <laughs> uh, me having to constantly press this on my finger is not, it's not great. Come and see. I love it when it crits. I love it when it crits so much. It's such a nice feeling. Um, just recently I found out that webkins is a is a thing still if anyone remembers what uh, remembers webkins um, I used to play it a lot when I was a kid and I mean they're still technically selling the plushes but they're not as fun or they're not as cute um, but they're they're still a thing. Um, like I said, I started playing that recently. I, I found some webkins that I used to have as a kid uh, that I remember having. Um, <laughs> uh, however, it doesn't hit the same because obviously it's not the same one. Um, uh, there was this thing called, uh, a Googles. It was like a weird duck thing and it was super cute. Uh, however, they only had pink and, uh, blue ones and mine was a white one obviously 
Uh, to, to, to say that I'm upset is a little is a much of an arrival. Uh, but uh, yeah, I I I've been playing that. Uh, I'm trying to remember what I had as a kid, obviously, so I can buy them again. But I found out that there's this little Peridot dog, and I want that because my birthday is actually coming up real fucking soon. Uh, it's like... God, it's like $12. Give that heal. Yeah. Uh, I probably should. Um... Uh, I, I've been- I play it for like an hour, and then I'm like, good. I love it. I love it. It's such a- it's such a blast from the past. So nice to actually- Um... What else? There- the- there's the love dino, which is a stegosaurus, and I distinctly remember it, it, uh, seeing it as a kid. And so actually seeing it as like a- a fucking... a thing. Oh, uh, fuck. A thing, a thing. A as a whip can say, you can buy. It, it made me so happy. I was like, it's 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 the thing. But, but then I found out that there's a cat. And I was like, heck yeah. So now I'm trying to figure out, I will be honest, chat. I, I, I'm trying to figure out how to make, um, make it into a into a stream thing so I can like excuse, have an excuse to buy them. <laughs> um I I I am also trying to ignore the fact that my I I'm not sitting in my chair. Um because my boyfriend and I we both live in a tiny room. We if I'm wanting to lay down or if he's wanting to lay down we, we have to have we have to move the chairs depending on who who's playing at what um so like last night i i think i don't know i think he was playing Skyrim. i'm not 100 percent sure um or he was just watching videos one of the two i don't know but i'm currently sitting in his chair and i absolutely hate how it feels um i i got a a really nice chair i, I like my chair it was like 200 dollars. i love my chair but it's a racer chair, and I've had it for about six months, I think, uh, or less than a less than a half year. Oop, I need that. Key. And it doesn't make it so like I, I will admit, probably going to be the like the closest not safe for work thing I'm going to say, but like it makes my it, that 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 chair. I love my chair. It, it doesn't hurt my butt. And I used to have a chair that was just a normal office chair, and that also hurt my butt. So it's just, it's perfect, it's perfect, it's perfect. Doing a thing, watching a thing, things were done. Azuli, do the thing. I don't understand, I'm sorry. I want a gaming chair about 300 USD here. Uh, if you're wanting to spend a little less, I, I, I think mine was about 300, it was about, it was between 250 and 300. Um, I would recommend Techni. Uh, hi Zach, by the way. Uh, but I, I would definitely recommend Techni. That's that's what my chair is, and I had to. I ended up getting this super pastel one that I need to actually wipe down because there's some there's some dirt spots on the white. It, it's not fun. Um. But uh, it's it's my favorite chair. I absolutely love sitting in it. I, I want a fancy office chair, but so expensive. Yeah. I just, I just, ah. Uh, <laughs> I hate it. I hate this chair. Like, this is, this is my boyfriend, he, he thinks it's absolutely amazing. He thinks it's like the best chair. And you know what? That's fine. That's his chair. It's his chair. He can think whatever the fuck he wants about that chair. Um, but yeah, no. Oh, I do want to let everyone know that I do have a Discord. Um, I do have the command ready, so if you guys want to join the Discord. 
I also have a Twitter and a YouTube channel, so if you guys want to catch some VODs that I don't have available here on Twitch, and you want to go see them on, um, on YouTube, they are there. Um... I do have that. The other thing also is, uh... I was thinking of... Ah, sorry. I was making badges, actually, earlier for stream. They were cute on high. Above? Oh, I was off. I was off. I was off. Whoops. I'm so sorry guys, I know, I, I just, I just started focusing on this. Um, but the reason why I bring that up is because, uh, Tyler, Tyler Runa, my boyfriend, um, he will, he will, um, play on Tuesday. He, he, we dub it Tyler Runa Tuesday, and he will play all sorts of random shit. Anywhere, anything between... Uh, Bloodborne to to Dark Souls uh, to challenge runs. Um, but just recently, he did a challenge run for um, for Skyrim. That was uh, a shield only challenge. Uh, I'll I'll sit end up actually being like part of it and everything. Uh, sometimes if he wants part of it, things like that. Um. It's nice because he gets to do his uh, his fun stuff. So if you guys do end up seeing if those who have followed and want to like actually like stay up with everything, um, if you end up seeing on Tuesday, someone. I mean, it is my boyfriend. He is... I, I say he's the funnier of us. I, I don't think I'm funny. Um... And he's, he's, he's enjoyable to watch. Sorry, I had to poop for a moment. Had to get into my house. That's fine. Did you have to break into your house? Oh, speaking of which, he's awake. I don't know what re reckless cats do. I was carrying stuff in mail, so I had to figure out my keys and junk. Oh no, that's fine. It would have been cooler if you were trying to break in, though. Mama stepped at our home, so they let me in. Okay. Yeah, we'll we'll end up um we'll 
we'll end up finishing this dungeon, and I guess we'll end up stopping for the night. Well, I found that. Remind me to show you something. Um. Oh, there's shit. There's another one. I forgot there was another one, guys. Help. Twitch, keep your fedoras on mod. Uh, we 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 we've all heard my issues. They're more of a cute uh, of the cute. I, I don't know, even then, I I still don't find myself funny. You know what, bitch? Come here. those warble in I absolutely hate those. I do these have to have to be a thing. We almost done. Bing Pearl. Yeah, we're almost done. Oh. I'm sorry guys. Oh It's a big dude. He made a growl sound. He went oh. He went raw. Oh. I minority talk with Mocha. Oh, I think it w I think I know what you're posting. Okay. the dude that we have to deal with? Oh no, whatever shall I do? He, he's summoning group that, okay. If I'm honest, I, I kind of have paid attention to the story, kind of don't. Like, there are times that I'm like, oh, okay, that makes sense. And then I'm like, oh, okay, that, that, that's a reference to, to Shadowbringers, obviously, or Stormblood.
but um, apparently my brain decided to go today. Way to for you to get your Mystic cast for Holy Spirit. And, uh, when is that, by the way? Is that like 74? Let's see if this works. Everything is off now. Damn it. 78. Oh, okay. for his gap. Okay. Yeah. I, I can't wait to get enhanced uh, Sheltron, actually. Seventy-four is the gap. Yeah. Oh, my dot. Who are interested? That's that's what I did. And his Sheltron is six seconds. Uh, that's what I want. I just I want the six seconds. I know I know it's nothing in a retrospective like a Paladin, but that six se seconds could actually go just a little bit longer. I, I would prefer that. But the block rate is actually nice. We did it. Yeah, 25 minutes. It, it, it takes me that long just to do these fucking dungeons by myself. Not that I don't mind. It's just it, it, uh, doing like 10 of them is straight. Not fun. Thank the gods. What happened? So they were unable to see the ritual to its completion. Then Garuda is no longer a threat. I bet you'll do the trust for that over your dungeons. But then fat XP. Yeah, I probably would. But we should not tarry. The knights have secured our path to safety. I wish they implemented trust system before. For like later shit. You'd better not have killed the primal without us. Who is that? The warrior's darkness, but who is that? You! Wait, I know you. Still walking, I see. I could have sworn my aim was true. Eh, wrong person. Just what is your game? 
leading us the long way so these fools could step in and claim our prize? Now, now, let's not make hasty accusations. By the look of things, the ritual was proceeding as planned. We arrived at the appointed hour. It was they who erred. It is hopeless. We cannot face them all. Do my ears deceive? A boy! So that's the way of it. Twins! You have lives in a mask doesn't there. fool anyone. I know, right? Know it's clearly uh, uh, Astinian. If you just stand still. Enough, Jarumal. We wouldn't want to upset the man in white with any unnecessary bloodshed now, would we? You've been awfully busy since we were kind enough to spare your lives. While you were idly consorting with the Asians, you mean? Seven hells! What could you possibly hope to achieve? Should I explain it to you? Very well. Consider it a reward of sorts for beating us here. You know the tale of Hydaelyn and Zodiac, I take it? Of the Great Sundering, and the reflections it created? Across ten and three they were divided. Reflections of the Source, each possessed of shards of light and dark. Just so. One of those reflections, the one nearest to the Source, is our home. And we were the heroes blessed with her light. But not all worlds hold light and dark in equal measure. In ours, the power of light was greater by far. So the Asians who once threatened our home were no match. And they fell before us, one after another, till none were left. Victory, we thought. And then came the light. A flood of pure, blinding radiance, annihilating shadow and color and life itself. Ere long, it will consume our world, leaving naught in its wake but blank perfection. That... that cannot be. Do you honestly expect us to believe such a story? Believe what you like. But it has happened before, on a world far removed from ours. The Thirteenth, which was swallowed by the dark and transformed into what you call the Void. Unchallenged light would condemn us to a similar fate. And so we joined hands with our former enemies, and with their aid came here, to the Source. But there is but one way to restore the balance and save our home. The Arda. Calamitous destruction with the power to break down the barriers between planes and see our worlds rejoined. You would doom our world to save your own? What would even become of us? Of you? Enough. I tire of talking. You know our cause. You know what is at stake. We are prepared to do whatever it takes. Are you? If there is aught you would say, say it. Otherwise, be gone. You have no friends here. <laughs> he sounds like Rain uh, from Xenoblade Chronicles. Uh, yeah.
sorry, like listening to that because I was I was looking it up. I was looking up the original Warriors of Darkness, um, and I was like, oh wait, that that was probably her name, but no, it's not. It's it's not her name. It's not the Archer's name. Um, so listening to that, I realized how fucking close everything was, and I'm not happy about that. So, so we listen to Rain's. It's uh, so close. Or it's the same beat. It might be the same beat. Let's actually be honest here. Alright. Let's. I got two quests until the next encounter of the Titan encounter, so I'm trying to decide what I want to do. Because again, I don't, I don't want to do this stuff. But... Got it. How are you feeling? I'm feeling not okay. I technically have three more badges I need to make, but I've made all of my badges pretty much. Again, I just need three more. Might be good to stop if you feel like you can't keep going. I just don't feel like playing. <laughs> it's getting to that point. But we'll 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 at least finish up this quest here. Alize, how are you feeling? Well enough, brother. Thanks to the kindness of our hosts. They told me you had departed for Zelfatol while I was still abed. I slept much better knowing that. Thank you. I take it your mission was a success. As if we needed any further confirmation that they are in league with the Asians. But to save another world, I think not. I too thought his story fanciful at first. But it is possible there may be a kernel of truth in all of this. At the very least, none of his claims contradict the word's account. You were following these people, Alize. Why? During my travels, I had oft enjoyed tales of the Scions and their exploits. But after a time, I began to hear whispers of a gifted and theretofore unknown band of adventurers. Adventurers who had supposedly sworn to travel the realm slaying primals in the Scions' stead. The Warriors of Darkness. And in the course of investigating these rumors, you stumbled upon the Asians' involvement. Yes, exactly. Forgive me, but if these warriors of darkness mean to bring about another calamity, to what end do they hunt primals? To prompt an escalation. To deepen the beast tribe's feelings of helplessness and despair, and thereby drive them to summon ever more powerful gods. And lest we forget, these events do not occur in isolation. With their patron deities being slain left and right, the news of man's victory over Nidhogg must surely have sown panic in the minds of the Beastmen. Tis no wonder they wish to defend themselves. Power answered with greater power. Death with more death. A vicious cycle fueled by fear and hatred. I know it's like all too well. Indeed. The Asians sow discord and desperation, and the warriors of darkness reap the harvest. And so it continues. Yet that is not the extent of their ambitions. The Asian himself observed that once the powerless realize that the old gods have failed them, they will have little recourse but to look to a new one. Realizing, realizing the 
Does that lead up to Shadow Breakers? Yeah, no, that's exactly what I'm thinking. I cannot let that happen. It should come as no surprise, but Alize and I have uncovered evidence that the Asians have been manipulating certain parties to ensure that a constant stream of crystals flows into the hands of the Beast tribes. If we sever these supply lines, we should at least be able to slow the escalation. I thought you were saying. I think they just wrote Agreed. something and then went. And I shall journey to Zelfatol oh wait. What we can of the Ixar's source. Then I, for my part, pledge to lead a similar investigation into the origin of the Nath supply. Sir Emmerich. As a member of the Aorsian Alliance, Ishgard is on a bound to play an active role in maintaining the security of the realm. You might also say that I have some personal motivation, given the Asian's dealings with my father. However, I make no secret of the fact that my knowledge of primal beings is scant at best. As such, I should be most grateful if one of your order were to assist me. They did, and then me, uh, they thought, what if... I have dealt uh. with Nath before. Let us consult with Orianja then. Given his dedication to the study of primal beings, I should be surprised if he could not tell us something of value. Like I said, I think it happened to be more of a quinkadink. Allow me to accompany you, brother. And before you think to refuse, know that I am not the girl I once was. I shall not be a burden. You have my word. But Alize, you. Mocha is a, su a sussy baka. Why am I a sussy baka? You are more than welcome. After all, it was you who set us upon this path. Wait a minute. I'm afraid I can't allow you to leave just yet. Not until you try on the new outfit I prepared for you. I'm not a sussy baka! Taru holds you at gunpoint and says strip. Yeah! Oh my god, I, I, I cannot play this game. I, yep. So, okay, yay! Alphano! Okay, yeah, no, I can't do this anymore. I, I can't. I'm so I'm ending stream because holy fuck, it's lagging on me real fucking bad. Um, so yeah. Thank you for those who came by and said hi and then stayed with me. Thank you, by the way, for the raids. Um, Viper and Avi. Um, tomorrow we'll be playing more Skyward Sword. Uh, I, I I really really don't want to, but I will. Uh, Tyler may end up helping me though because I have the rhythm of a deadbeat cat. So. Uh, yeah, that's the thing. Um, thank you again so much for, for stopping by, uh, for, to, to the new followers. Welcome to the kitten family. Um, I think that's it. Sorry, the game was, like, super laggy on my end, so I do, do I have to make a list of games you haven't completed on stream? No. No, you don't have to. Also, whoa, whoa, what? Goodbye, thank you. I may have to come late, but thank you for the stream. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm about to brap. Why are you about to brap? Oh my god. Alright. Thanks for a good stream, Mocha. You're welcome, guys. You're welcome. I'm sorry about my technical difficulties and the fact that Final Fantasy is deciding to take up a lot of my CPU. So, anyway, um, I, I again, I appreciate you all who, who came by and said hi. Um, again, thank you for the raids, and I hope you guys have a wonderful night.